It's our top story tonight at 10 o'clock. A busy intersection has the community of Pleasant Farms demanding change. They say it's a matter of life and death. CBS 7's Macy Marigi joins us now in the studio with that story. Macy? Tatum, over the last several years, residents in Pleasant Farms have seen too many fatal accidents. And for many, it's hitting a little too close to home. Now they're ready for something to be done. Jamie Tisdale is up at the break of dawn every morning, Hi. serving the regulars and many passerbyers at Wilson's Corner Store in Pleasant Farms. She's owned the store for over 17 years, and in that time she's bore witness to many horrific crashes at the intersection of Highway 385 and FM 1787. My help rendered aid in two separate accidents out here where the people literally died in her arms. I mean, I can't tell you how hard that was on her. Tisdall says this intersection is a recipe for disaster with the high speeds and amount of traffic that comes through on a daily basis. We've way outgrown this intersection. It's the same as it was uh, 30 years ago and we have thousands and thousands of more people come through this intersection. She's been pleading with TechSot for two years to make changes. So if we could get the county to pitch in any amount of money, uh, ideally about $150,000, it could come sooner than later and maybe save a life. And now, she says, she's starting to make headway. $100,000 worth of work, well, they'll, they'll widen the turn lanes and the road itself. According to TxDOT, it would cost a total of $500,000 to put in a light at the intersection. But Tisdell says the current project is a start at least. We need something and we need it yesterday. Jamie Tisdell continues to request meetings with county and state officials to accomplish her goal. Live in the studio, Macy Marigi, CBS 7 News.